One of my favorite mid ranges that's overstable is the Pyro. I've got it in three different plastics. Do they all fly the same? Are some of them a little bit more stable than others? Let's find out. Hey guys, I got the Pyro here in Plasma Prism, Neutron Prism, and Proton Prism. They're all the exact same weight. We got a super gusty, windy day, which is a great time to test out some overstable discs. So let's see how they fly. Numbers on the Pyro are 5402.5. So it's a great overstable mid. I just got the Plasma Prism Pyro. I've thrown these other ones before, but let's start out with the Plasma. Super excited to see how these fly. Yes, nice overstable glidey disc. I just love that for approach shots. So good. Proton's definitely one of my favorite. It just looks so good, especially in this yellow plastic. See how she flies. Very similar. Loving this all day. And then I got my good old double stamp DFX Neutron. Now this one is probably the flattest out of the two. Oh, definitely goes a little straighter, maybe because of the flat top. I don't know. This is a good start though. Make sure you guys stay tuned this week. I got the MVP open drop disc that I haven't done yet. Got the rhythm and the shift that I'd like to test out. A little too gusty to be throwing those in an open field today. So we're gonna save those for maybe Tuesday, Wednesday. So stay tuned for that. If you guys are looking for the other MVP open discs that have come out, you can check out my links up here and stay tuned later this week. I got the Nuance and the Crux from Thought Space Athletics. Can't wait for those. All right, guys, we're gonna keep testing these out. Like I said, super gusty day. So this is perfect for testing out an overstable disc. If you ever have swirling winds like we have today, pull out those overstable discs, rely on them. That's what they're designed for. All right, let's go with the Neutron first. We got a basket out there. We're just gonna try to head for it, see which one will get the closest. All right, I do feel like the Plasma and the Proton are a little bit more stable. Not sure if that's just in my mind yet, but let's keep throwing these. Oh, see how that wind is just taking it? But, oh, that's a perfect example of why you should use overstable discs in the wind. Did you guys just see how the wind was toying with that, going up and down, and yet that overstable disc is solid, did the same flight? That's why you guys need to rely on these in the wind. All right, Proton. Super reliable. That's beautiful. If you're not super familiar with the flight numbers, do you have the last two numbers being a zero and then something in the two to four range? That's pretty much a stable to overstable disc. The larger the last number, the more stable it's gonna be. Those are the type of discs you can really rely on, especially in windy conditions. All right, so far, all three of these are very overstable and I'm loving it in the wind. Now we got a little bit of a tailwind. Let's do a little sidearm shot. We're gonna go for this basket here. Gotta say, Neutron on a sidearm got me an ace at the beginning of the year. So I gotta say, kind of in favor of the pyro on sidearms. So let's go, let's see if we can get something close. Let's go Neutron first. Oh, the wind. Wow, my goodness. Man, that tailwind just shot that disc down. But like I said, these overstable discs, they're gonna fight against the wind, whether it's tailwind, headwind. That little pyro fought to get off the ground, still gave me some distance, super impressive. All right, really digging this plasma. It's nice and flat top also. Let's give this one a little bit more height because of that tailwind. Oh, there we go. What a fighter, wow. Guys, like I said, we've got some really gusty winds. It's swirling all over the place. That's why I kind of put the drivers in the car today. We'll maybe get them out tomorrow if the wind calms down. Proton Pyro here. Oh, there we go. Nice. Disc Golf Deals USA has this exclusive stamp. Bridge to Gnomeware. Two of the discs I'm throwing today have it. My buddy Skeet designed it. Super sick disc. It's an exclusive run, so as soon as these are gone, they're gonna be out. So you guys need to snatch these up. All right, we're gonna do one final shot. We're gonna kind of set up some obstacles here. So we're gonna have to go high to the right, have something crash down to the basket over there. 
This looks like a great shot to just put a pyro nice and flat to that open area to the right and then just trust that it'll come back. Really digging the feel of this plasma. The thing I like about the plasma pyro, I feel like it's got a little bit more grip and give to it, which feels really good. So let's trust it on that nice straight line. Here we go. Nice and flat, straight, watch it work. Oh, get in. Oh my goodness. How did that not go in? All right, same line with the Neutron. Oh, that's great too, get down. Great shot. Last but not least, Proton. Oh, the wind's just toying with it. Pyro says, no problem, I'll get you inside circle. Well guys, if you're in the market for a nice, reliable, overstable disc, that's nice and flat top, feels great on backhands and forehands, nice and shallow, which is the thing I really love about this overstable mid. I'd check out the Pyro, should you go Proton, Plasma, Neutron. I don't know guys, I could bag all of these. I do have to say the Prism one I've got, it's got a little bit of dome to it. So if you like discs with a little dome to it, might wanna check that out. But the Neutron and the Plasma are definitely super flat top. I really like the Plasma one. I just got this one from Disc Golf Deals USA. The grip feels great. I love how flat top it is and shallow it is, but I've bagged the Neutron before. I bagged this one before too. So you can't go wrong with either of them. In fact, I think I told you already, Neutron got me an ace at the beginning of the year. So. Let's see if the Plasma one can get me an A sometime this year too. All right, if you guys are looking to get some discs like this, go over to Disc Golf Deals USA, use my code, save 10%, and stay tuned for the disc reviews of the Rhythm, the Shift, the Nuance, and the Crux, which will be coming out this week. Till I see you next time, peace out.